I'm going to be doing a camping haul for you guys. Zach and I are going to be going camping on Saturday. We're going up to Grand Marais, which is something a little special for me and Zach because that's where he actually proposed to me. So I don't know if you guys can see it, but like that's my ring. It's so pretty. Um, so I just thought I'd show you guys a little haul of everything that we bought for this trip. Um, some of the stuff is from Dollar Store, like a good 95% of it. And then the other stuff is from Target. And there's one item where I don't know where it came from. I got it last year for Zach's birthday, I think. And it's either from Fleet Farm or Walmart. So um, I'll actually start with it because why not. But it's these um, compressed towels where you just add water and it like expands into a towel that... Like, I don't know if you would, like, necessarily reuse them again, but, like, it's not necessarily, like, a washcloth or, like, a dish towel. It's more, like, I guess, like, a good example is, like, if you were eating s'mores, you could use this because, like, it would actually do, like, a better job than, like, a napkin would because it's obviously wet. Um, so I thought that that would be really great. So I have no idea where I bought this from. Like I said, it was either Free Farm or Walmart. It might not even be those places. So, um, next I'll start with the dollar store stuff. I'm actually going to start with these two things. Um, the first one is a magic towel. It expands in the water to a washcloth. I actually have one of these already. Um, the two that I have today are Disney related. So, this one is Ariel and Flounder. And this one is Dory and Destiny. I think. I think that's Destiny. Um, these are great. They actually, like, you can reuse them a bunch of times. I have one that I got when I moved out of my parents' house. And that was almost four years ago. So, it's, like, sad. Like, I don't, oh, I didn't realize that I moved out almost four years ago. But anyway, I thought that this would be really cute, you know, for showering and whatnot. And I just... They had a Frozen one, couldn't find it. They had a Cinderella one, which is like my Disney princess. Like, I'm Cinderella. Uh, well, I'm not Cinderella, but like I am obsessed with Cinderella, but couldn't find that one either. So, um, ended up with Ariel and Dory because who doesn't like the Little Mermaid and finding Dory? Um, the next thing, oh, I should have organized this. The next thing is these scouring pads. They're like rainbow colored. Um, I get these at the dollar store all the time because you literally just remove, like, dirt from your dishes and, like, nasty food and, like, why spend a couple dollars when you can get 12 of them for a dollar? It just makes sense. I mean, you're going to be throwing these away every couple of weeks to begin with. At least I hope you do because your kitchen would stink if you didn't. Um, so yeah. Um, the next item... I'm going to try to like, stick with like the kitchen -y stuff right now. The next item are these uh, measuring spoons and measuring cups. I mean, they're just really basic. A fourth a teaspoon to a tablespoon and a fourth a cup to a cup. So I don't really need to show you each, in each individual one, but there's that. And then... I don't know if this will be any good, but I just thought, why not? It was a dollar, but it's this lemon pepper seasoning. I put this on, like, everything. And then the next one is more of, like, a grilling one, and it has barbecue. Oh, where's the next one? Barbecue Texas lemon pepper, which is that one. Charcoal barbecue. Steak and chop. And then barbecue Texas again. I guess there's only four. But um thought that'd be really neat to try on like your chicken and whatnot. And then I just thought this was too cute. Just a little baby strainer. I mean it's like small, very small. I don't even know if you could get like a box of macaroni and cheese in this without it like kind of going up to like here. So that'd be interesting, but it was really cute. And then 
Um, we got three sets of paper plates. Um, we used these last year when we went to South Dakota, so I know that they're heavy duty. They aren't going to like be really flimsy because I've used them. And then two things of your cups, red cups, like red solo cup. And um, I don't know if we're going to need more than this or what, but we got two packs. I don't know, like super exciting, but plastic forks and spoons and then your, oh, okay, it has spoons, forks, and knives, and we got two packs of those. Um, Zach has a camping, like, kitchen set that has forks and knives and plates and pots and pans and whatnot, but just in case we don't want to do a lot of dishes. And so, that's that. Um... And then I had to go to two dollar stores to actually find these. I got two of the pop-up hampers. Last year when we went to South Dakota, um, I read on Pinterest that these could be used for, or not read, I didn't really read it. It was like a camping hack. But you can use these for like your garbage. You just put a bag in it, which we did and it worked awesome. Or... Obviously, what it's meant for is your dirty laundry. So, I got two of them one for garbage, one for your dirty laundry. And then, um, Zach threw this in as just some plain cotton twine, you know, to hang up your towels because, you know, nobody likes to use towels that get really wet and damp and gross. And I hate using wet towels, it just grosses me out. So, got this. And then we got clothespins. Gotta have them. And then Zach also threw in the cart some lighters because they're three for a dollar. And, you know, it helps start fire, I guess. The grill, we don't have a grill. But, um, oh, like the propane for the burners and whatnot. So we're gonna need, need some of these. And if you lose them, who cares? And then, oh, with our hamper pop-up thing, this is our trash bags. There's eight of them, I think, Zach said. Yeah, eight, duh. I think there's above it, but eight bags, which should be more than enough because we're only going to be there for five, five days. So, that should be good. And then Zach also, like, this is how he floss his tea, so he just picked up a pack. He uses these pl plackers dental flossers um yeah this is what he uses I just use normal floss but whatever um and then he got I think he has two body washes um and I think they're both the stormy sea scent and then the other scent or the other one is shampoo but those two are in the shower right now so I don't know if he's planning on using this for our trip but it's part of the dollar store haul so I'd show you I don't know what this smells like, so. It smells like not as strong as like a blue axe would smell. Like the blue axe bottles, but I like it because it's not as strong as it. But it has like the same scent as the axe, so it's really nice. And I couldn't resist because I'm a little kid. I got these little um, windmill things. I think they're called windmill, or no, pinwheel, sorry. I just like whacked myself with the tank. I thought these would be cute for like, um, like break fire tent, you know, where you'd park the truck. I don't know, I just thought these were cute. And I couldn't resist, and they're at the checkout. And I'm a sucker for the things that are in the checkout lines. So, got that. And two more items for the dollar store. I got these cheap flip flops because they're really cute, actually. So I got pineapples and like a tiki head thing, and then what are those? I can't. Um, a tiki bar, a luau, uh, guitars and stuff. Like they're just really cute, and I'm gonna use these in the shower. Like they're not like quality because like 
but it's like you cannot stick it like in it just pops out and but for the shower these will work great because I hate putting my feet on the shower floor in a public restroom that's just disgusting that's so gross to me so I just picked up this pair I don't know what that was so um got that and then I'm gonna use this as my shower bag but it's just a pink and white flowered bag a little tote um it's got like the little thingies in it but I'll show you how big it is so I can put like my body wash maybe even my pajamas and like my washcloth in here just carry down my um my actual like bath towel so there's that oh sorry that you guys are shaking so much you guys are literally on a stack of books on my bed with something behind you so you don't like tip backwards because I'm using my phone and like every little move I make the whole bed will like wiggle so I'm sorry um hope it's not like too noticeable because like on my phone I know it's noticeable damn oh well and then from Target I think I could have gotten these at the dollar store but I forgot to even look so I just picked them up I got these little travel bottles for you know, like my body wash, shampoo, and conditioner because I thought it'd be cheaper than buying the little travel sizes of shampoo and conditioner and body wash. Just squirt yours in here and take it along. And then I have the the, the up and up brand of the wet cleansing towelettes for your like removing my makeup and making sure because I like to make sure my face is like really clean at night I take my makeup off with um some soap like makeup removing soap that I have and then I wash it with actual face wash but I just figured it'd be easier excuse me it'd be easier to use these while we're camping and then lastly <laughs> Zach knows this but I have to have um, first aid, like a first aid kit, anywhere I go, because I'm always tripping, I'm always cutting myself, I'm always in the need of a band-aid or ointment, I just, I need this, I really need this, so, um, I'm actually, like, really accident prone, so, if somebody specific is watching this, my finger still hurts from when I cut it off, or cut the tip, so, yeah, that's our, or, well, yeah, it is our camping haul, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Um, Zach's still working on editing a video. He bought a new truck today, so he's been really busy, and he's been really stressed because he's wanted a truck for, oh, for a really long time, but he was stuck in a lease with a car, so finally got rid of the car and got his truck, and so he's just really excited. And so you'll see him soon, I hope. <laughs> But we're probably going to do some vlogs for this channel while we can't because it'll be fun. Give us something to do. So, yeah. We'll see you guys soon. Bye.